adjusted the idle up one gain, doing better now. Idle up two gain is a little too high on the tail, but I fly in idle up one right now. Practice flights I like to do in idle up one. Lower head speed a little, uh, the bird is not that twitchy, it's calm, it's more, uh, it doesn't want to get away so fast. So as you can see, it's stable in hover. And the collective to tail compensation is pretty good too, for now. I love two needs a little more, so I might add some, but that'll be on later stage. little bit of tail wag on a high um, high collective maneuver where my blades want to stall I think that's more because my blades are softer aligned blades are much softer than any radix or anything else that you would fly I mean, good good they're amazing blades don't get me wrong they're just softer so they tend to vibrate under a lot of load sometimes Good to just practice sometimes, just a hovering practice. Kind of gets you connected a little more with the bird. On the controls, of course. <laughs> no hippie talk here. This battery is a little too powerful. <laughs> I've seen a lot more head speed on this battery. It's a nanotech battery that I'm running. See on Idle Up 2, this bird just wants to rip. I love how connected this helicopter feels whenever it's on. I mean, I set up my BSTEX once and I've forgotten about it. I really have not messed with any settings. I see a little bit of tail wag, but I don't mess with it right now because it only happens on these new batteries. On the older batteries, which I have a lot of, it tends to be perfectly fine. Alright, enough of this battery. 